We have a uh, volunteer who has stepped in to fill some of our time since we have a missing speaker. If you could introduce yourself and uh, tell us what you're going to talk about. Hi, uh, my name is Michael McMahon. I work in an OEM in Norwood, and I make uh, I build high-performance computers and compute nodes and so forth. Uh, my job is to deploy any OS that's not Windows. Uh, so that's CentOS, Red Hat, Ubuntu. Those are the popular ones. Um, I'm, I want to pick your brain. If you have seen this screen, um, whenever we've updated to uh, CentOS or RHEL 7.5, I'm seeing this splash screen on Supermicro X10 and X11 boards. Um, it doesn't happen with 7.3, and it doesn't happen with the mainline kernel if I update from the L repo. Um, doesn't affect anything else. It's just the splash screen. Um, so I kind of want to just open up the floor real quick. If anyone has seen this problem on any other boards, um, or if anybody knows anybody at Red Hat who works on RHEL. Probably a timing error in doing the VGA switcher, switching from the first linear Hmm. Any ideas of how to fix that? Is that does that fall on Rel? Does that fall on CentOS? Is that Supermicro's problem? Is it my problem it now? Because be I brought those, it up. Actually, it could be any of those. <laughs> uh, I, I don't really know uh, what else to look for. Frame buffer. Kernel bug. Okay, I haven't seen it in any other OSs. Um, it does have to do with the kernel, uh, I think. I, um, I would think so. Yeah. So you say it's VGA swapping? Uh, I haven't tried that. Yeah, there might be a kernel boot option that will, because um, I'm assuming you don't really care what graphic code this hardware is in. Um, I mean, like, we try to stick to defaults as a yeah, rule of thumb. I mean, if you could have it as a low resolution VGA that worked, it would probably be okay. But once the actual OS is loaded in, it all looks fine. Um, um, it's just affecting the splash screen oh, where it's. It's uh, it's like, um, it's on uh, legacy mode. Um, <laughs> all right. Has anybody else seen it on anything that's not super micro? Okay. All right. Uh, well, that, that's all I have. Um, my only other CentOS project is on GitHub, um, technology, project, uh, technology Classroom, PXE, Pixie. Uh, I have all my configs on there to set up a WDS server that chains to a uh, Pixie for any uh, deployments. Thank you. <laughs> 